All new tonight, a South Florida restaurant owner is locked in a flag fight. She's being ordered to take down her American flag. So she called Help Me Howard with Patrick Frazier. We all have goals and dreams. Nikki Marchalos does, and one dream came true. I love it. I have put everything on hold in my personal life just to make this a success. Nikki bought this space in a condo building and opened Nikki's Orange Kitchen in Pompano Beach, serving not just organic, but good tasting organic. We have a full service smoothie bar, fresh juices, organic, and organic coffee bar. We also have a full liquor bar, and we serve amazing food. Nikki had a mural made of fruit and vegetables to put on one door. And I feel very strong about our flag. And she's very proud of being an American. So on the other door to her restaurant, she put up this small American flag with the words, God bless America. My brother's a veteran, and he, was, he fought in the Vietnam War. And my father was a Navy soldier. She likes her murals and loves her flag. And then... I got a letter from the board. You have to remove your signs because you never got permission. Her restaurant is on the ground floor of the plaza at Oceanside, and she has to follow condo rules. So she asked for permission to keep her murals on her door. And they said, no, permission denied. Nikki was stunned, and it got worse. Next thing I know, I get another letter, and it's stating, you're being fined $5,000 per mural and $100 a day. As the daughter of a veteran who went to war to fight for the flag, Nikki made a decision. I'm not taking it down, no. Nikki knew she'd face hurdles opening a new restaurant. She just never expected to have to fight to keep this flag on her door. I have to stand for something, and this to me is important. Well, Howard, can the Condo Association make Nikki take the American flag down? An association can make her take down the drawing of the fruit and vegetables, but not the flag, because they are relying on their document that prohibits signs, posters, billboards, or other advertising devices, and the American flag does not fall into those categories, so they cannot block her from putting up the American flag. We contacted the association. Their attorney sent a polite email saying, unfortunately, we cannot comment on an ongoing legal dispute between the association and an owner. And then the association cited a different condo rule to make Nikki take the flag down, saying, Nikki cannot make improvements or alterations without written approval. Nikki still won't back down and won't take this American flag down. This will now head to mediation and the association needs to back down because the next step is court and Nikki will win. I love Help Me Howard. Nikki now has two goals for the new year. Make her restaurant a success and keep her American flag on the door. I'm looking forward to a beautiful new year and I, I believe in goodness and that's where I'm gonna put my money. We'll keep an eye on this and we'll let you know what happens to Nikki's American flag. Now, hopefully they'll settle it in mediation because if they go to court, whoever loses has to pay the winner's legal fees. And Howard thinks Nikki will win, so the association members will have to pay her attorney's bill. Someone cooked up a problem that's left you stewing, ready to turn the heat up on them? Flag us down and let us whip up a tasty solution. Will this help me, Howard and Patrick Frazier? 7 News.